All right, YouTube, welcome back to another video. As you can tell, hair scrambled today. Bike's already loaded, gear's already ready to go. I gotta go pick up Ryan and uh, get unloaded. I'm sure there's gonna be a ton of people. There always is for these things. And it should be a good time. It's not too bad outside, it's like 45. Let's head over, get Ryan all picked up and loaded up. I just got the bikes unloaded here. We're going out. I didn't film anything. We're in a rush, of course, to get out there. So should we get it going? We'll get a bunch of GoPro riding footage. And it should be fun. Yeah, we're good. You're good. Good luck.
next day here, came home, didn't actually film anything after the uh, end of the race. I gotta get this bike all cleaned up. It's gonna be wonderful to wash now that it's set overnight. This thing is all chunked. I scraped some of it off after when it was fresh. But um, this thing is definitely gonna take me a while to get all this stuff out. I have to take the skid plate off. But grip tape job held up good on both sides. Not too bad, honestly. Didn't even scrape up. Came off a little bit right there, but pretty solid nonetheless for what it is. Get this power washer fired up, clean all the gear and stuff off, and get this thing done before it gets dark here. Now that it gets dark at like five o'clock. Should be good enough now it's under the light i can see everything it got pretty dark fast here it's literally like 5 15 it's pitch black outside which is sick things pretty solid aside from that as soon as i took off um on the start i realized that when i put the hand guards on um i didn't actually tighten up my clutch so my clutch the whole time kept falling like straight down like that i kept having to like hit it up so that it would stay in place every single bump i would hit it would instantly just like drop down like that pretty much didn't use the clutch the whole time contemplated pulling off to tighten it up but it wasn't really worth it i just kind of dealt with it the whole time aside from that had a good time and uh just overall just wanted to finish the thing i didn't care what i got i just wanted to finish the race and get through it i think i ended up like 17th out of like 30 some odd guys which like i said i don't really care what i got i'm not really don't really care to be competitive like that with this and I uh, just wanted to have fun, finish the race, and uh, I did that. So overall, can't complain. Let me know in the comments what you think. Um, if you like this video, I know it was a lot of GoPro. There's not really much I could have filmed aside from that. Um, but for the guys that like the GoPro stuff, should have liked this and the racing hair scramble type deal. Script tape off now and clean underneath there. Pretty much did its job pretty good. Didn't actually wear through at all. Just hope when I go to edit this video, the GoPro isn't completely like covered in mud, the lens the whole entire time. I think I got like 45 minutes of GoPro footage before the SD card um, got filled up in that camera. The battery actually died. I got a little bit of footage, hopefully, to make a full video. We'll see when I sit down. But from that, like I said, let me know in the comments what you think. If you want to see more videos like this one. And with that, if you guys are new, make sure you're subscribed. Give this video a thumbs up. Share with your friends. If you want to see what's going down before the videos come out, you can follow me on Instagram at Tyler Monaghan. And with that, I'll see you guys tomorrow in the next video.